A new study says the closure of automotive plants could be contributing to opioid deaths. News 5's Meg Shaw breaks down the research for us. This is a pretty shocking study. The authors looked at more than 100 counties to get their results. Of those 100 counties, 29 had auto plant closures. And they say it was in those counties that opioid overdose deaths were 85% higher five years after the plant closure compared to the counties that didn't have the closures. The authors say major economic events like a plant closure can affect a person's point of view on life and can have some profound impacts on their mental well-being. The group most affected in this study were white men between the ages of 18 and 34, followed by white men between the ages of 35 and 65. The authors also say the results of the study show this isn't just about plant closures, but it's exposing the problem of prescription opioids and the concerns with overprescribing of drugs. Plus, the need for interventions for regions hardest hit by economic change. This year, General Motors shut down three U.S. plants, including the one in Lordstown. For News 5, I'm Meg Shaw.